Okay, let's go. It's time for a solo opening of 100 Dango Boxes because Dango Boxes are fun and I love them. I mean, I love myself some Dango. It's very fun to buy Dango Boxes. And then look at my bank account. Definitely not very sad. I should probably set the UI scale to like 1.2 in case I get something good so you can see the effect. I'm not counting getting anything good about its life. Sushi Chef had? Holy shit. Another one. It's truly a gamer moment. I'll, I thought I'm gonna get another one. Holy shit. Dango Pan. They're, they're like dirty cents. Some money back at least. That's not any money back. That's like 7 cents back. Not even. Dango PW is surprisingly cheap for how decent it looks. Cargo Salamander. Cargo Salamander is not a bad backpack. It's just not very useful for any good outfit. But it's funny. It has a funny Salamander on it. Sushi Chef hat. I'm so happy that I get Sushi Chef hats. Definitely does not make me cry. So if I'm gonna go 100 in zero, I'm gonna be very upset. Cause that happened to me more than once before. Dual katanas. I have a crazy luck with dual katanas. I don't know why. I don't know why out of everything dual katanas is what I have to get. Why not like anything else? Like anything good. Just classic dual katanas. Maybe the mythical ones would be nice. Actually, I got a burning ones, which were pretty decent, but they still have like 20 euro max. But that was something. It's burning dual katanas. So I think I still have them. Too lazy to check, but I think I still have burning dual katanas. I hope I didn't sell them yet. Because I, I know myself would sell them for a quick sell price on the market. Oh, that's mythical. Let's, oh, yeah, that's mythical. Okay, I thought it's a D jump for a second. Let's see what I get. Oh, talking about burning, I already have this. <laughs> I already, wait, uh, scroll. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. Did that work if I, I did ask for gonna do this, okay. Well, that's first 19 boxes, first mythical. It's pretty decent. And there's cloak cloak, just the mythical. The burning one is, looks decent though. Switch characters to this one. There we go. I can even see the scroll cloak if I am not retarded enough. Yeah, you can see I have it equipped. Very nice. I like it. I give thumbs up to that one. Oh, another one. Okay, that's pretty lucky so far. Second mythical. Let's see what it will be. Hopefully something good. Glitch scroll clock. Holy shit, a scroll cloak clock? It's the third scroll clock that I have, but it's not very good. That'll be fully honest. And the mythical is really up, holy shit. It's two scroll cloaks in a row. I don't like scroll clocks too much, I'm gonna be fully honest with you guys. Another one? No, that's a DJ helmet. For a second I was hoping. Me like scroll cloak. I like how it has the physics in the back. It like floaty. And three determines in a row, okay. The, each of them is like 80 cents I think, so it's like... I can't complain too badly about getting them, it's like majority of the money back. Like it's a skin that gives you biggest money back from, uh, from the whole case. Obviously unless you get a mythical. Like from non-mythical non skins, each element is the biggest money back. This one's still too great, you used to lose, but at least you don't lose that much. You lose something like a small-ish percent of the money. So it's kind of like, acceptable. I think go? No. DJ helmet. Three DJ helmets already. It's three times almost money back. Oh, never mind, that's losses. I hope I'm gonna get at least one more. That'd be nice to get at least one more. I doubt it because I have a really terrible luck of cases. Like, did this getting two mythicals in a row was 
really lucky for me. Uh, in a row, not in a row, but like within the span of few cases. Two dual katanas in a row. <clears throat> I don't like when I get that. I hate dual katanas. They sell for a decent price, but I hate that I get them so much. Anytime it's a dual katana, it could have been a mythical instead. But instead I got like 20 plus dual katanas already. Not 20, I got like almost two pages of dual katanas. I to sell them all for like market price. That's the one thing that really surprised me after opening so many cases is that like how much more money you make back from cases when you don't quick sell, when you just keep it on the market like one cent under the with the price one cent under the thing that's above. You actually make like, like 40 to 50 percent more money back, which is like pretty worth it considering that you don't have to even wait that long. Like right now I have like 500 listings because I open a lot of cases. And I made like, what, like 120 euro from them so far? Just from reselling what I had. I'm not counting mythicals, I'm just reselling the normal skins. Oh, that's a mythical. No? Oh, okay, that's the Oh, never mind, it is. Okay. That was. I, am, I apologize for skipping that one, but it's a bad one. It's not very good. It's Sky Lantern. Headband. It's not very good. I'm gonna equip it, but it, I don't like it too much. I'm not a big Sky Lantern fan, I'm gonna be fully honest. I'm not a, not too stoked about that one, I'm gonna be fully honest. Not the greatest mythical ever. I could just pull up Steam and check the price, but they're like, lazy. That happens, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm a very lazy person. When it comes to like checking mark, I always, when I open cases, and I need to know prices of things, I just go ZJS, price. And ZJS always prices for me. But he can't complain, he like he likes to price things because he likes to go to the market history and shit. We all have something, so. Some of us like to have life and some of us like to price things for 18 hours a day. Just like ZJS. I'm kidding. I also like to price things. It just takes way too much time. You wanna see how much time it takes to price the skin? I will show you, okay? Okay, look, I will show you how long. Let's say the scalender, okay? You go to market. Whoop. You check lifetime. This one is actually really fun. What the fuck? This is the like, flattest price I've ever seen. 10 to 15 euro. That's a. That's surprising. Like, these are quick sales. These don't really count, but like. Seeing a price this flat is not usually not. What the fuck? It's a really liquid skin in that case. Well, nah, it doesn't sell too much, but it's the, the, the price on this flat, which is quite nice. I like to see that. I like to see liquid skins. I like those. I like it when the skin is liquid. No, but for it's skin that really surprised me in how liquid it is are the the auras that always are like for like a month on the market in a stockpile and then they are then they get discontinued they, they are really liquid they sell a lot they sell like a few times a day actually like i've checked market history for those and they whew, they sell a lot lot like if you want a liquid skin in unturned i i recommend those <clears throat> like the fire crown ice crown i think that's how they're called the Wicked aura or how it's called, I don't know. The, the horns looking thing that up this up so disgusting and terrible. I'm sorry, if you, if you like it, I, you're weird. I don't like it. No, no one who I know likes them. Everyone likes them only because they're fucking liquid as fuck. The one thing that I like is that you can... The one that I like is the night aura. That one looks pretty decent. But it's also very expensive. I think it's like 50 on the market. You would have to pay for it to get it. Which is, yeah, it's a. It is some money down from your account, but you can resell it real quick for basically the same price. Maybe even more if you get lucky. <clears throat> I 
I actually wonder if there's someone who has like shitload of these auras in his inventory as a, like a sub currency to pay with. Because I can imagine that it could work to pay off things just with those. Like you want to buy an outfit and you give him like fucking seven of those auras and just pay out an outfit. I could imagine perfectly working as a sub currency like under TF2 keys. Like TF2 keys superior will be still superior to that one but the auras could be like a accumulated currency that you could just use whenever you feel like you want to use it because they're not that easy to get unless you buy them from market like you can trade for them but it's gonna cost you but like once you have them you can resell them fairly quickly it's, it's a quick balance for your steam basically obviously only for your steam because something doesn't have any like things that like csgo market that's not that's significant i think it's gonna be the last one for today but let's see what it will be Burning Dragon, dude, what are the chances of these things happening to me? Look at this shit. Uh, burning bur- <laughs> I already bought all of these skins before. <laughs> I even have it equipped right now. Ah, Keep getting these skins that I already have and that I already bought before. Interesting. I could set the price to like 23 euros and someone probably buy it. It's interesting. Very interesting. Okay, last in cases, let's see. Dual katanas. My least favorite skin. I don't feel like I'm profiting from this opening because I got mythicals, but they're all like very mediocre mythicals. But I think I'm gonna be pretty close to breaking even on this one. Which you're always happy to see in unturned unboxings. Like it's really hard to it's like in bigger unboxings like this, like 50 plus boxes, if you open it's really hard to make profit. Unless you get like really lucky with a mythical of good effect. Obviously. That's what we are that's why we all do it. We all wanna make kind of a profit. Or at least unbox something that will look nice. I like the idea of generating new skins. You know the idea is pretty sick. Okay, last one I click open. Anya mask, okay. Let's see, what did I get today? 